Hi there. Welcome. Come on in and get yourself nice and comfortable. And how are you today? Okay. Well, I can see here that we're going to be doing an auditory processing exam today. Is that right? Okay. We're going to start with a short questionnaire and then I'm going to take a look in each of your ears, just to check there's no blockages, inflammation, anything like that, before we put on some headphones. And then you're going to listen to some whispered numbers and whispered phrases and a few beeps. And then once those headphones come off, listening to a few rhyming pairs and some clicking and the sound of a tuning fork. How does that sound? Okay, great. Well, what we'll do then is we'll start with this questionnaire. They are yes, no questions, so have a think about them and answer yes or no for me. So the first question, in conversations, do you sometimes feel like you're missing something? Do you use spell check often? When you have a hearing test, do the results often come back absolutely fine, showing no abnormalities? Do you enjoy concerts or singing karaoke? Do everyday noises like the vacuum cleaner or blender hurt your ears? When you're in an open space, do you have trouble focusing? When you were in school, did you find lectures difficult to follow? Would you rather express yourself in written form, messages, an email, something like that, and avoid phone calls? Okay, just a few more questions. Would you prefer a face-to-face -face meeting rather than an online one? Do you sometimes miss important phone calls because you haven't heard your phone? When you go out with friends, do you sometimes struggle to follow what's going on? Do you sometimes mishear words that rhyme or sound similar? Okay. And do you have the television on at high volume but still have trouble understanding what's going on sometimes? Okay. Well, that's all my questions for now. Thank you very much. What we'll do is I'll use that information when I'm putting the report together at the end. Do you have any questions for me before we get started? Okay. I'm just going to put the clipboard down for a moment, put on a pair of gloves. And then if it's okay, I'm going to have a quick look in each of your ears. Is that all right? Thank you. So, I'm going to use this otoscope. It has a little light in it, I'll show you. That's what it is. It just goes in to your ear very gently, just so I can have a good look at the eardrum. I'll start with this side. If there's any pain or any discomfort, please just let me know and we'll stop, okay? Great. This side first, ready? Okay, here we go. Okay. Just taking a look, checking for any 
wax build up or an inflammation around that eardrum. It's looking all nice and cleaner. Yep, that's fantastic. That's nice and clear. No problems in there at all. This side next. Ready? Okay, same again. Here we go. Once again, just taking a look. There's no wax in here at all. Nothing to worry about anyway. And I can't see any inflammation. So we have two lovely shiny eardrums. That's fantastic. Oh, good. Was that okay? It wasn't uncomfortable at all. Okay, well, there were no problems then. Right, so what we're going to do next is put on a pair of headphones. When you've done that, you'll be hearing me through the computer microphone, but I'll explain to you what we're going to do as we go along. When those headphones are on, we're going to listen to some numbers in each ears, and we're going to listen to some phrases, and they'll all be whispered. Once that's been done, you'll listen to single and double beeps. I'll explain it all again as we go, okay? Right, so. What we'll do is, we'll put these headphones on. Once I've put them on, feel free to just adjust them so that they're comfortable for you, okay? Okay, ready? Okay, here we go.
that one again and this time increase the volume again for that 
The sound the dog dry leaves outside these bills. What phrase did you hear in your right ear this time? Okay. This time I'd like you to tell me what shape.
short break again. Finally, before we take off the headphones, what I'm going to do is play you some beeps. There will either be one beep or two beeps. And you need to tell me if you've heard one or two. Is that okay? Great. I'll play you an example of each so that you know what I mean. How was that? Okay, good. We'll just give you a couple of moments for your ears to adjust to hearing normal sounds again. Was everything okay? Any problems there? Anything that worried you at all? Mm -hmm. Okay. Hearing normally again. Fantastic. So I'm going to read you out some words now. The first set of words rhyme and the second set of words sound very similar. Okay, so for the rhyming words, all I need you to do is say them back to me. Okay, so they come in twos. Okay, ready? So your first pair of words are top, cop. Fantastic. Your next set of words, tight, kite. Good. Your next set of words, Call, call. Great. Your next set are late, wait. Following that, leap, weep. Then it's fan, van. Next is free, three. Two more sets. Sour, t. 
power. C T Fantastic. Any problems with any of those at all? So, this next set of words, there are fewer, but they sound similar, so you'll have to listen very carefully to see if you can tell the difference between the words. So once again, if you could just repeat them back for me. Is that okay? Fantastic. So your first set of words, back, black. Your next set, foe, flow. Following that is dip, drip. Next is grow, go. couple more. Side, slide. And finally, sip and skip. Fantastic. Well done. Just a couple more tests to go. What I'm going to do now is use a pen light, but not to shine the light at you. I'm going to be using the clicking sound it makes. Okay. And what I'm going to do is make the clicking sound next to one of your ears. I'd like you to close your eyes and tell me whether you hear the click on the left or the right. Is that okay? Fantastic. Okay, what you need to do is close your eyes for me, please. Fantastic. So, listening for the click. Okay, here we go. Ready? Was that on your left or your right? Good. And again, ready? Was that on your left or right? Good. Listening again. Was the click on your left or your right? Good. A couple more. Ready? Was the click on your left? Or your right. Good. Last time. Ready? Left or right? Fantastic. You can open your eyes. Any problems following those clicks at all? Finally, what I'm going to do is just strike a tuning fork. It's a nice low frequency. And just place it next to each of your ears. And I just want you to let me know how it sounds. Okay? Just describe the sound that's going into your ears. Okay? As best you can. This side first. Ready? Okay, here we go. And on this side. Ready? Okay. Now, 
One more time on each side. This side first, ready? That's great. And one final time on this side. Ready? Okay. So, what words would you use to describe how that sounded in your ears? Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Well, thank you very much for that. That was the last of the tests. Thank you for being very patient with those. Is there anything that you would like to add to my notes? So I've been making notes as we go along. The computer has been taking note of your responses. Is there anything you'd like to add? Anything that surprised you? Anything that you weren't sure of at all? Okay. Fantastic. Well, what happens now is I'll go away, take my notes, take the computer notes and put them all into a report for you. I'll share that with you and you can then share that with your doctor, audiologist, anything like that. So, I'm seeing no problems with hearing, but we might want to look a little more deeply at the processing. But as I say, discuss it with your audiologist, discuss it with your doctor. If when you've had a look through, you're not sure about the results, then give us a call and I'll be happy to explain them to you. Or if there are any of the tests that you would like to redo, go over again, then please just give us a call and we'll get you booked back in. But in the meantime, thank you very much for coming along today and I look forward to seeing you again soon for some of your routine tests. Take care.